Well, hello and a warm welcome from the gateway to some of the most picturesque scenery anywhere in England. We're at the Vitality Stadium. I'm Derek Ray, and I'm joined for expert analysis by Stuart Robson. And we've got Premier League action coming right up. It's Bournemouth taking on Chelsea. Well, Derek, as is always the case, the team that dominates midfield will be the team that controls the flow of the game. And that, for me, is the area that's key today. And the starting 11 for Bournemouth. Well, on paper, they look a very balanced team. But the three advanced midfielders must at times make runs beyond the centre forward. Otherwise, they might just lack a bit of penetration. And a look at the Chelsea starting 11. Kepa is the goalkeeper. Kai Havertz starts with Raheem Sterling out wide. And the lead striker today is Joao Felix. And the game begins. Enzo Fernandez. Mateo Kovacic. Really getting stuck in. Philip Billing. Joao Felix can he finish this and a goal to open the scoring a very bright start to this one well here it is again the through ball is wonderfully executed and then from that sort of range Sterling was never going to miss it's a well worked goal And back underway, 1-0 it is. Christie. Well, possibilities inside the box. Oh, good work by the keeper. Going short. Mepham making sure it didn't get past him. Another corner conceded. What can they do with this one? Now well, a short corner here. Uatara. Making sure nothing came of it. Top class defending. Mateo Kovacic. And room now out on the flank. Options in the middle. Not the best clearance. Well, they can bring it out now. Dominic Solanke. Oh, that's a really good run. And the keeper more than equal to it. Who can he pick out? 
It comes to absolutely nothing. It's a perfect challenge. Being pressed and pressed high. Mateo Kovacic. Kovacic lost it. And Sterling has it. And on to Felix. He takes aim. Well, flinging himself up the ball. And a short corner, let's see. Kovacic, able to get a body in the way. Felix. And just wide of the post. Decent effort there. Felix. Interception to snuff out the danger. Jefferson Lerma. Oh, that's a pass of high quality. Well, just over the crossbar. Excellent effort. Well, as you can see, Chelsea have dominated the last 15 minutes and their attacking play has been excellent. Surely only a matter of time before they extend their lead here. Yes, yeah, really going so well for them and who knows, they might be able to craft another opportunity. A very good tackle. Guattara. Kukureya. Enzo Fernandez. And the keeper has it now. Kukureya. Here's Kovacic. And threading it forward. He's in behind the defence here. And a goalkeeper on top of his game. Well, it's great goalkeeping. What a big save that is. And the short option preferred. In by Sterling. Well, he wasn't messing around with the clearance. Getting in there to intercept. Jefferson Lerma. Determined defending. Mateo Kovacic. Well, on the cusp of the half-time interval, it's Chelsea in front. And Stuart, an opportune moment to get your take. Well, it's been a tight game so far, but they've just had that little bit more quality on the ball, particularly in midfield, where they've just started to take control. They'll be fairly happy going at half-time if it stays like this. And options in the centre. Not a touch off the defender, last of all, so a corner. Well, it's been a while, but these fans are now coming to life. Can they equalise here? Keen to take it short here. Oh, this is looking promising. Intercepting it intelligently. And Chelsea get the decision from the referee. Mateo Kovacic. Difficult to stop him, but they took care of the situation defensively. Soranke. Sustained pressure and they have the ball now. Lewis Cook. Now with Lerma. 
Watara. And a Bournemouth throw coming up. Well, they no longer have the ball. Joao Felix. And the referee blows the whistle. The first half is in the history books here at the Vitality. So back underway here into the second half. Well, excellent from the keeper. That's a really top-class save. So, making the substitution now. Going short. Kovacic! Oh, he's missed the chance to extend their advantage. Well, it was a decent effort, but not quite good enough to extend their lead Bournemouth doing well to regain possession really be able to trouble them here a wonderful intervention Mateo Kovacic Sterling he takes aim and a fine stop to turn the ball away Jefferson Lerma and a strong tackle Joao Felix and he takes it on oh, no degree of difficulty for the goalkeeper out of play for what will be a Chelsea throw Kai Havertz and Sterling has it and they'll be happy to have regained possession Lewis Cook 30 minutes to go then opportunity to deliver the cross Taken away, he won the ball. It is a decent looking attack here. But the danger averted for now. Sterling. Here's Chilwell. Opportunity it is. And that is defending of the highest order. Philip Billing. Lewis Cook. Lovely ball over the top. Quite simply, an opportunity wasted. Easy for the keeper. Of course, stats don't always tell the story. But on this occasion, they certainly do. Because they haven't been good enough in the top third of the pitch. And I'm not sure we're going to see anything change here. Well, in possession now. Let's see what they can create. Oh, he's given it away. Oh. 
free kick to Chelsea. deciding to test the keeper but no problems really great effort to keep that one in play and into the last 15 minutes of action not high quality defending well, the big question with the final whistle fast approaching is this. Can Chelsea see it out? Stuart, what have you made of their performance today? Well, it's been a tight game, but I think they've been the better team. They've just had that little bit more quality, certainly in attack. And of course, they've been well organised at the back. They just need to see this through now. Mateo Kovacic. On the ball, Joao Felix. Sterling. Could be it, and it is. He's done it. Surely a case of game over. Well, as you can see, he hits this with so much power, but just look at the follow through. So athletic. That's a dynamic strike. So underway again, and a 2-0 advantage here. Senesi. Jefferson Lerma. Possession one. Well, the flag has gone up here. Offside it is. And with play stopped, they will make the change now. Substitution for Chelsea, coming off the pitch, number 8, Mateo Kovacic, to be replaced by number 23, Conor Gallagher. Chris Meppen. Now with Ryan Christie. Crossing opportunity. And a corner kick, the referee's verdict. Playing it short. That's a nice looking ball. Well cleared away. Traore. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Kai Havertz. Havertz. Getting in there to intercept. Not much time to make up his mind. Perfectly positioned to take it away. Smith now with Ryan Christie Joao Felix happy to take on the shot and there it is the final whistle a frustrating experience for Bournemouth and the fans around the world a defeat here Stuart how would you sum it up well, once again, they were all over the place defensively and I can't see them improving because their tactical understanding and positional play is non-existent. Something has to change quickly.